Hey kids, welcome. Yeah, so in this video and many other videos similar to this one, we're going to study sequences of numbers. And sequences are just lists. So when I say sequences of numbers, I mean lists of numbers. And of course, we would like our list of numbers uh, to have a pattern. Because if they don't have a pattern, then they're not interesting. And so why would we study them if they don't have a pattern? Now, uh, the very first list of numbers or sequence of numbers we're going to study is called the Fibonacci numbers. This is a very famous um, list of numbers. And it's actually frequently called the Fibonacci sequence. In any case, the Fibonacci sequence is very famous because it's got an interesting pattern. Uh, it starts with a 1. So the first number on the list is a 1. And then the second number on the list is also a 1. What? So is this just a bunch of 1s repeating? So is the next number also a 1? Well, I don't think so, because if that were the case, then it shouldn't be so famous, right? But the next number is a 2. And this is not enough. Three numbers on the list is not enough for us to guess how this works. So let's get a few more numbers. Because right now, I'm tempted to say that the next number should be a 3. Um, because it looks like we just like repeated this one, but after that, it looks like we're just counting as normal. One, two, and let's see what the next number is. It's a three. But then the next number should be a four if my guess is right, right? I'm saying we repeat the first number, one, one, but then after that, we're counting normal. So we're going to go one, two, three, and the next should be four. But wait, the next number is a five. So what is the Fibonacci numbers? What is it doing? Is this enough numbers for you to figure out uh, the rule? If not, I'll give you one more. So how about now? I think now we should be ready to have a hypothesis. And a hypothesis is like a guess, uh, an educated guess, in fact. So I think we're ready for an educated guess or a hypothesis. And I think this should be our hypothesis. I think that this 2 here is 1 plus 1. So this 2 here is adding the previous uh, two numbers in the list. So we add 1 and 1 to get this 2. And so then if this is the rule, this 3 here should be adding the previous two numbers, which for 3 is going to be adding 1 and 2. But 1 and 2 is 3. What about this 5? 2 and 3? Is that a 5? Yes. What about the 8? 3 and 5, if we add them, do we get an 8? Yes. So if this continues, then the next number we haven't seen yet should be 5 plus 8 or 13. Is it? Drum roll. And it is. And so we figured out the Fibonacci numbers. We figured out how it works. The next number should be 21 and so on and so forth. The list actually never ends. But now that we see how it works, we know how to get more and more numbers. So we'll say that we're done here. Uh, like I said, there'll be many more sequences of numbers to come and many more videos. So uh, look out for them. But I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you also liked the Fibonacci numbers or the Fibonacci sequence. Yeah. All right. Okay. Uh, take care and talk to you next time.